Yeah, hi there. Uh, these comments are for Morelli. So let's take a look at your email. So you say, last time I got 78 on the TOEFL, reading 24, listening 25, speaking 18, writing 11, and I want to retake my exam on August 28th. Will you please help me how to get a good score in TOEFL? Please email me as soon as possible. I need to get 90 minimum. I'm very bad at reading, a very slow reader and writing. I also got a low score because I need to improve my rephrasing, integrated task, and punctuation skills. I got good news for you. Uh, you have good news. Uh, number one, congratulations on 78. I know that this is not exactly what you're looking for on the TOEFL, but your reading is already pretty strong at 24. Listening is, is 25, so you have 50% of the way you're doing really well. I can help you the rest of the way. Usually with speaking and writing, there's a few things that you can do that can dramatically affect what your score is. And one of them is organizing and making sure you organize the independent and integrated uh, speaking and writing tasks around the question. So that's something I can definitely help you with. Uh, with your writing, I do have some specific lessons that focus around rephrasing and specifically uh, what's called paraphrasing, which is the same thing. So I can definitely help you uh, in those areas. Of my seven-step system to pass a TOEFL IBT, uh, probably you want to focus a lot. Uh, your speaking's 18, so you probably want to focus on step two, which is my pronunciation lessons. You also want to focus on step seven, which is my speaking lessons and practice test. And also for writing, you can probably focus in my grammar uh, lessons. And I have two specific lessons which focus around punctuation, everything, when to use commas, when not to use commas, how to use semicolons, direct quotes, and uh, so on. So if, if you study the, the grammar lessons, that's going to help you for both your speaking and your writing. And then step six is my writing lessons. I have a series of independent and integrated writing lessons to help you uh, better organize, develop, and respond to these independent uh, and integrated writing tasks. And kind of what we do morally at my seven step system to pass a TOEFL test, so there's really no right or wrong way to use a system. You're the subscriber, you're the one who makes the payment, right? So you study based on my advice or based on your own desires, what you think is going to help you the most. And then when you're ready, and what you need to do is you need to begin taking a lot of my speaking and writing practice test. And from there, you'll start making some changes in how you respond to those tasks, I think. So it's a combination of you taking some of my lessons and getting some of my feedback, I think, which helps you make the, the improvements that you need to move your writing. I, I can understand this. You're not happy with that. I wouldn't be happy with that. So you need to move this writing up closer to 24 points. So we need to double your writing score and even a little bit more than double and with the speaking score we need my goal is to help you get maybe anywhere from five to eight points higher than where you are right now I think it's possible the question now is I have a lot of information everything that you need the question is how bad do you want to take to pass a TOEFL test I mean how hard are you willing to work because if you take the practice test at my website, then I will score those, evaluate them, and give you feedback on both your speaking and your writing TOEFL proficiencies. All righty. Anyway, Morale, thank you very much uh, for contacting me. And all the best to your high-scoring TOEFL success.